Hi, everybody. Leslie McGrath from Scrapping Life Away at blogspot.com here to do step four in our blogging by fives. And if I can find, you, you would believe the mess I've got here. I'm trying to find the, um, the name of the step. <laughs> Basically, it's step four, and it's words and um, focal points on the page. I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to come clean. I've cheated. Um, last night, while I was not watching my Cleveland Cavaliers lose last night, I was looking through my journal, and, you know, I had to do some cleanup work in it because it just I just wasn't happy with it so I had to go in and play a little bit and play I did much happier with it now um, and you know I do have a lot of scrapbooking supplies I have a Cricut and all of that fun stuff but you know with journaling by fives I've kind of um, kind of used this number one to step out of my comfort zone but also number two to get back to the basics um, of simpler things, I I enjoy creating really fancy pages and you know that really don't even fit in a scrapbook itself. But I enjoy that. But I have really enjoyed doing this, and it's kind of brought me back to back to the basics. So I've really tried to not use um, anything that I've cut out on a Cricut. Um, or anything like that. Um, I'm not a good fussy cutter, um, so I really use this to fussy cut. I don't tear pages. I've been tearing pages. Um, I have scrapbook paper. Um, next journal, you know what? Maybe I need to start tearing some scrapbook paper because God knows I've got enough of it. Um, but like I said, to create something out of what I have around me um, has been really... Uh, just stepping out of my comfort zone. It used to, you know, when I go to scrapbooking crop, it takes me one day to do one page, scrapbooking page. And we crop from 10 o'clock in the morning until midnight. Um, we know the owners of the shop, and I have a private crop that I do once a month. And it's a hoot. We have a blast. I think we laugh more than we create. But that's kind of the reason why we do this anyway. But anyway, that's how long it takes me to do one page. And for me to do this has been a huge accomplishment for me. And I just want to thank Shannon for coming up with this great idea and letting me do this. So I'm about to embark on step four. And I have my timer here. So, like I said, I did some work in here. My focal points have been cut out. My words have been cut out. All I have to do is glue them on the pages. So, let's see if I can do this in 15 minutes. If not, I'm just going to keep going because I, I'm i just going to keep going because I, I get close every time, but not quite there. So, we're going to see what we can do here. Now that I've talked, talked to you guys probably to your board silly but all right here's my clock here's my timer I'm gonna open my page I'm gonna open my glue sticks so yes like I said there's been work done ready set go That big fat one. There it is. See, I figured it out. It would be like 45 seconds per page. Well, I don't have, I'm not that fast. I try to be, but I'm not. And that's okay. Two, three. Four, five, journaling by fives. One, two, three, four, five.
Ugh. See, I'm probably already past that 45 second mark. Because I don't have a lot of magazines, you know what? I made a lot of these myself. I don't want to cover up that handle. It's a thrill ride. Ready, set, go. I never thought a Butterfinger wrapper would come in handy. Keep your hand. This is made out of paper towels. Can you believe it? Yep, paper towels. I know I'm spending too long and I'm probably shaking like a leaf because you know what? I had three cups of coffee today. Keep your hand in the game. And Dr. Pepper with lunch. So yeah, I'm shaking a little bit. All right, there you go. Keep your hand in the game. So little time.
so little time. Recharge. And renew. Are you for <clears throat> real? Question mark. This guy just looked funny to me, so I cut him out. This guy with a bunch of pickled fruit or vegetables or something. Are you for real? And then down here, I used stickers and cut out the word pickled. He's not straight. I know, who cares if he's not straight? Well, I kind of do. I want his head to be crooked, the jars to be straight. Are you for real pickled? Yesterday when I was, or Saturday, when I was doing um, step three, I was taking my stencils and um, pressing them onto paper to bloom where you are so that, um, you know, my stencils wouldn't be full of paint. I stamped these out of... Um, that paper. So I recycled it. Bloom where you are not sticking where you are planted. Bloom where you are planted. Okay, here we go. Fun page. <laughs> All right, y'all know I live in Indiana, and one of the greatest basketball teams in the state of Indiana is Butler. Well, this guy has a real soft place in my heart because the night my granddaughter was born, it's April 4th, 2011, and Butler Bulldogs we're playing in the NCAA championship against UConn. Never understood March Madness until we moved to Indiana. I'm not kidding you. It's like the whole freaking state shuts down. This is Blue. He is the mascot for Butler. He's actually number two. He's Blue the second. And I haven't got my words um, yet for this guy. I know what I want him to say. Shoot. Pass. 
class. So this is kind of, this is Butler Blue, the second. That's why this page, I was so excited about it because I knew blue was going on this page. And uh, I mean, he's, he's kind of special to us, so. There he is, Butler Blue. Isn't he just adorable? <laughs> A bulldog. <laughs> okay. Moving on. You know, I'm not even checking my timer. Just so you know. I mean, it's up there. It's going. I don't want to sound afraid to check it, but yeah, kind of I am. I am her voice. I am her voice. I'll put those butterflies on during free play. I know. I worked on this page a little bit. This reminds me of my dog. She doesn't look like that, but she's spoiled rotten. And she likes to sit on our laps because she thinks she's a lap dog, even though she's 40 pound piece of baby. Love me, love my pet. There we go. See, cute. Imagine the dream. Then there's more I want to put in here, but I need to get something started there. There we go. All natural beauty. And she is beautiful. Seriously? Stopping the clock. Not me. I'll tell you how many pages I, I have left to do in a minute. Get her down first. I just think she's beautiful. One, <laughs> two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine. Seriously? Nine pages. Well, you know what? I'm sorry. Sorry about ya. Oh, ripped it. See? The gods are saying, shame on you, Leslie. You're breaking the rules. The art gods are not looking down on me right now. Yes, they are. 
because I think artists break rules. Here we go. I heart you. <laughs> Love it. I'm just going to keep going. The quicker I move. You know what? And the clock wasn't even going when I was talking to you guys before. Maybe I was explaining blue too much. Sorry. He's kind of important. That'll be a day that I think, uh, well, of course, when you have your first grandchild, that's a day you never forget. And that's what it was. It's the day my first grandchild was born. Well, first grandchild to biologically be mine. My husband he has a beautiful grandson. Juicy fruit. Juicy fruit. So we're juicy. We're supposed to go up a little bit higher. Isn't that funny? Juicy fruit. I have stuff cut out for free play. But right now, I'm just going to put this on. Because, oh, guess what? I'm short on time. Life's a dance from one stage to the next. Almost all these things, the words that I've cut out for the most part are all paper towels. Oh, that almost ripped totally in half. Dreaming. Vacay. Dreaming of Dreaming of a vacay. Don't tempt it. There we go. Dreaming of a vacay. Okay, glue stuck to my fingers. I'm going fast. I'm trying to. <clears throat> this is out of a book.
dance like nobody. is watching. Dance like nobody's watching. Still, still have to wait for my butterflies. Although I did punch some out, those I have to wait for free play. my son. The beauty of reinvention. This girl's rocking it. She's sassy. I think she's sassy. I got I got this. All right, this is a funny page. He's breaking through the saloon door. <laughs> Be sure my clock should go in the right direction.
Time to go. <laughs> Time to go get totally ripped. <laughs> And all the clocks, and he's being thrown out of the saloon. <laughs> Six cents of humor. Sorry. No, no, I'm not sorry. That's kind of who I am. Okay. I believe this is the last page. That's a wrap. Times. <laughs> Times up. Go the distance. There we go. All right, let's flip through. It's the longest video I've ever made. Sorry, guys. Thrill ride. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five. Keep your hand in the game. My butter. There we go. My butterfinger wrapper. So little time. Recharge and renew. Are you for real? All those vegetables pickled. Bloom where you are planted. Blue. Bulldog blue. Butler blue. I am her voice. Devotion. I'm on a short leash, spoiled, rotten, furry friend. Love me, love my pet. Imagine the dream. All natural beauty. I heart you. Juicy fruit. Life's a dance. I was going to name it something else, but life's a dance. Dreaming of a vacay. Dance like nobody is watching. Homemade butterflies. The beauty of reinvention. I got this. Time to go get totally ripped. <laughs> go the distance. Time's up. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you all have a great day. And uh, I'm excited. Step five's coming up. Have a great day, everybody.